Forest Protection. And today I'm here to talk to you about a brand new line for the United States market, Origine. Now Origine was originally started in Italy in, in the fall of 2010. And over the course of the last five years, it's become a very popular brand throughout Europe. And it's focused primarily on the Italian lifestyle components that you would find in brands, motorcycle brands and, and scooter brands alike, like Aprilia, Ducati, Vespa, and, and all, of the, uh, all of those types of brands. And for our market in the United States, we decided to bring in part of the brand and we focused it around initially four open face models. And the model I'm gonna to talk to you briefly about today is called the Pilota. And it obviously gets its name from the fact that it looks like a pilot style helmet or a copter style. And the shield on the front can be removed with the use of screws, uh, but, it, but it stays in the down position primarily during riding. And it has an anti-fog and anti-scratch um, uh, coating. This is a thermoplastic alloy shell. It is DOT certified, and this helmet has an incredible plush crushed microfiber liner. It's very, very soft. It almost feels like suede, but it wears very well. The cheek pads are, are uh, removable on this model. You'll notice several wonderful appointments on this helmet that really set it apart from a lot of the other helmets in this price range. Now, you'll notice the what we call the baseball stitching around the edge. That replaces the need for a rubber trim gasket, and it just adds a certain amount of flair and style to the shell. And in addition, you'll notice that it has reflectors here on the back corners, so that in the event of uh, evening riding, twilight riding, someone with headlights will actually We'll be able to see that because this will reflect back on them. This helmet is a intermediate oval head profile, so it fits very, very well on, on a North American style head. And it's available extra small through extra large. Check out the Origine Pilota. Hey everyone, I'm Matt with Chaparral Motorsports. Today we are going to talk about the Torque T14 Full Face Street Helmet with Blink Communication System. Let's have a look. So what do we have here? We have a full face street helmet that comes with a Blink communication system under 200 bucks. So it has a tremendous value factor here and it looks great. We're gonna talk about the unit more in just a second. First, let's go over the helmet. Now what you get here is an ABS shell that is lightweight, it's durable, and it's DOT and ECE rated for safety. And just the overall appearance of the helmet looks very aggressive, has really clean lines, and I like the ventilation system. You have a defroster in the front that's fully adjustable, an intake scoop at the top of the crown that's adjustable as well. You have the two positions open and closed, and then you have a series of extractor vents, including some vents on the side to really give you that nice flow through effect and get some fresh air pumping through the helmet. The face shield, it's optically correct, it's fog free, scratch free, and what's really cool is that they add tabs on both sides so it's easy to get to with either hand. Now, the other value factor that you get with this helmet is that it comes with a drop-down sun visor that has a very smooth motion to it, which I really liked. The mechanism to change the shield out is pretty basic, but it's simple and straightforward. You have a little lever at the very back, it's gonna pop that shield off, and then you can make changes on the go. Now on the back, you're also gonna notice this spoiler. This is gonna create some downforce and also some stability with the helmet. I will say that this is gonna be more beneficial to those of you that are in that three-quarter riding position. It's not as aggressive enough for the full tucked and you really don't wanna wear this in the full upright. So three quarter is gonna work best with this helmet. Now this is more of an entry level. Again, it is under 200 bucks and the Bluetooth unit has some basic features that will get the job done. I'm also gonna recommend that this is a helmet that's gonna be perfect for rider to passenger. Now the Blink system is very low profile. You can see here that it's almost seamless with the side of the helmet. It's very easy to control because it has very few buttons. You have a control button in the center that is a push button. It has multiple functions and it also has a bit of a jog dial that has a quarter turn stop. So refer to your owner's manual, make sure you get comfortable with this and all the settings before you take off. Now talk time is about four to six hours and you're gonna see 12 hours of standby you have really about a range of 30 to 50 feet if you decide to do rider-to-rider -rider communication or intercom. 
The other great thing about it is that you can stream music, MP3 player, you can get turn by turn directions with your cell phone, you're going to get GPS right into this helmet, and the speakers are already integrated into the cheek pads or the side of the helmet rather. You will see that it doesn't have a boom system for the microphone, it's tucked into the padding, and the charging port's at the back of the liner and it's very discreet and you don't notice that it's there. As far as the actual liner itself, it's very comfortable, it's plush, it's going to be moisture wicking, you can remove it and wash it, just make sure you be careful with all the cords with that system there. So that is just a very quick look at the Torque T14 Mako full face helmet with the Blink communication system. There's tons of color options available, you can find them all on the site shopmoto.com. Don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube, I'm Matt, thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.